<laughs> I pissed off the Quetzal. Oh shit. Oh, I pissed off the Quetzal and everything is coming here. One, the, it was one shot that just turned the tides. What is going on again, Nerverators? Thank you guys so much for coming back to hang out with us today. We're playing some more Ark Survival Evolved on the center server for the final time. Today is the finale episode of Two Men, One Base on the center. And I'm joined here with that man, Rex, in front of our base. We're going to do a base location and base, base reveal for you guys today <laughs> as part of the finale because we haven't shown off our base at all and it's one of the most requested things that we've had the entire season show us your base show us where you're built at and many of you have actually guessed it but before we get into it what's going on buddy what are you doing what's today no, are we gonna have some fun today hopefully we've got something scheduled here we're showing off the base but we also have a bunch of people on the server who have gotten together they've had plenty of time to set up and they are going to launch a full-scale assault on our asses today. So it's going to be two men defend one base for you today. Now, we're going to run to the front, and I'm going to try to show you a little bit of what they are dealing with. Uh, they've had plenty of time to set up. I think it's been, what has it been, like 48 hours or something? We were just, like, said, okay, everybody get together. We're not going to mess with you. Let's launch it. Something along those lines. But we'll show you their stuff. And we'll show you our location now. Careful. I, <laughs> I'm inching up. <laughs> Some of you may have already kind of guessed where it is from seeing beds on our uh, on our map. But here we are, all the way down at the bottom, in the Redwood Waterfall Cave, which is an absolute amazing place to build on the center. It's my new favorite spot on the center, for sure to build. But this is kind of, They've even gone so far as to paint their stuff. Let's get up on this rock so I don't get absolutely lasered. Okay, no, let's not get on the rock. They got a, They brought a Titan out here. They got tech gates. They got a whole freaking. I mean, you can't see much, but just our b-holes are prepared. So let's go back inside before anything terrible happens to us. Because I am Nick, guys. This is Nerd Parade. Welcome to the channel. And thank you so much for coming to hang with us today. Rex, what does that fob say to you? <laughs> does it say prepare our b-holes because we might be in trouble? Yeah. I think it kind of does. Sense. This is our first line of defense. Our interior turret wall of doom. We've got a tech Jenny in there. One of the most beautiful things about unlocking the tech is the doors. Oh, dear God, it's the doors. There's nothing really on the sides that we have other than a turret tower here and there. We don't have much. We're two, we're very two simple men living a simple cave life together. Yes. We just like to put our hands on the walls. <laughs> Clearly, as you can see from the, the mural in the back. Our dino collection, some of the gigas that we've managed to steal and hatch out and breed and whatever we've got. Our forge area, the whole base is just peppered in turrets. This is kind of how we roll. We've got Princess Penelope freaking sparkle farts over here. A princess wouldn't fit, so it's just Penelope sparkle farts. But we, do, we did tame the unicorn, which was kind of fun. It's been painted ridiculously, and it's Rex's favorite battle mount. Go ahead. I, I relinquish Penelope sparkle farts to you. As we Thank show you. off the interior of our base. Da, da, da. It's not anything crazy, super out of this world fancy. It's very practical. This is just how we roll. Interior turrets, some stuff. We're like totally, we're totally turret capped at 100. And then we've got 75 on the wall. And then 40 on each of the little pillars on the side of the ramp. So we're, we spaced them out as best as we could to get as as close to 300 as we can. We've got our little interior thing. We've got our fancy little tech force field that I don't think anything is currently in. We need to power it. And now would probably be a good time to activate this, don't you think? Do you have any, uh... uh yeah. Okay. I got element. You're the pro. Let's activate, yo. Are, are we gonna... What are we gonna stick it at? Uh... Like, it doesn't need to be... It doesn't really matter. Max... Yeah, it's... I mean, it's pretty... It, it powers up in five minutes. We'll, we'll make sure that yeah. it covers the entire base. This is its maiden power-up. We've never turned it on before. Never had to, yeah. I know, right? It's amazing. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna see if these guys are ready. We're letting them. We're totally letting them launch their full scale assault on our asses. We're gonna see if our base survives. We want them to succeed in wiping it. It would be a really cool way to send off the season as the two men one base base 
is wiped off the face of the center arc. Wiped off the face of the arc? The center arc. Ah, whatever. Anyway, it would be very cool if they succeeded. So we're letting them prepare as much as they want. We're going to give them a few moments. I'm going to run up to the... Uh, I'm going to set point at the front gate. We're still going to fight hard. We need to defend ourselves to make sure that our names are remembered in the halls of Nerdvala. And let's see if they can't push it through. So we're going to see and resume as soon as they're ready to go. We'll be RB. All right, we're, we're posted up. This is a little bit of the furious shitstorm that's about to rain down upon us. Brontos for days. They've got tech gates. They've had plenty of time. They have a battle ram stationed up on top. <laughs> I, I really want to shoot it. I really... You see it. Oh, good. You killed it! <laughs> you, you killed the battle ram! Buddy. What was it? It was named my buddy? No, Rambo's butt buddy. Rambo's butt buddy? Oh, that's feel poor Rambo feels bad. He's getting he's getting slayed. <laughs> <laughs> well, the Rambo's butt buddy got oh god, here comes the charge. So Titan? It's coming off the cliff. Oh, Rip Sickles did it. Okay. Um <laughs> it fell. It fell. <laughs> I I guess the Titan's gonna be going through the trenches. What do you do you wanna sit here? And try to like fend this back, or do you just want to kind of let it happen? I think we should let them get to the wall. Okay, it's gonna shoot before they, yeah, get to the waterfall. So let's see how uh, this plays out. They got yeah. the Yudi to buff. That Yudi is gonna start taking some hits pretty pretty quick. I want to see how far they can get. I want to see how deep these guys can go. Oh, here it goes. There goes the tech turrets. It is all just cut loose. <laughs> we killed Boner? <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, rip one Bronto. All of these other Brontos are starting... Oh, the, the Titan. They're taking they him to the side. Oh, they're taking him down. They're taking him down to the trenches, I think. He's getting shot right now. I think having the Titan go down there might have been pretty smart. They completely avoided our death wall. That's no, our... he's getting shot by the death wall. Oh, yeah, by the corner? Yeah. Oh, nice. I... Part of me wants to go assault the Titan. The other part of me wants to let it go. Oh, the door's open. I'm jumping down. The door's open on the back. No! Let him... Oh, shit! Oh, shit! I just... Did he stomp on you? <laughs> I... Don't rightly know... That was a grapple dysfunction? I think he might have. I'm shooting the guy on the Titan. I'm pretty sure that it was that I killed myself from fall damage. Oh my god, we're, we're back up at the carnage. The Titan is fine. It's still there. Rex killed the guy off the back. I actually ran up and got my kit and grappled up here. The Brontos are still marching into the wall of death, but it looks like they're turning around. We're not interfering much. We're letting them no. just kind of do their thing. I want to see how far it can go and hopefully not embarrassingly, embarrassingly die again in the most ridiculous way. If that Titan goes down, it's game over. Their full assault has just failed. But there's... Oh, yeah. Is there still nobody on it? I hopped down. And you said no. It doesn't look like anybody's on it. Yeah, no, no one's on Oh, shit. Careful. That's exactly That's exactly what happened. You're dead. That is exactly what happened last time. It just slides you right off. It slides me right off. It's getting melted, though. What the t I'm dying. I'm getting... Uh, it's not me. I'm getting super arced right now. I'm getting yeah. the most arced. I think they're getting arced as well, though. That feels bad. Yeah, you're right. This thing is getting shredded. I just came back naked. I'm going to grab my kit again. Careful. I think it's on, like, aggressive or something. I just slid right off the back of it. I feel so ripped off. <laughs> I'm going to grab, grab a stone. Oh, I can't. These aren't actually stones. To oh, grab. it's mad at you. It's mad at me? Yeah, look, it's coming right at you. Come here, you titan. I'm gonna defeat you nakedly. I'll show you how we do it in Nerd Parade Tribe. With turrets. <laughs> I don't think he can get through. I think he's actually stuck on the rock. Yeah, I think so. That big rock right there. The big That big rock is our best defense. Mm -hmm. There it goes. Oh, there it goes. Done. Ripperoonies on the Titan. Let's see if I can get. No, I can't get by. Okay, they lost a Quetzal. 
and a clam slam. That Bronto is probably going to tail swing me. Get my kit. Get my kit back. Woohoo! Professional kit getter. There's a dead Quetzal out in the front here. Brontos are running around the side. Let's put my stuff back on. And boots. And boots. And boots and pants and boots. The Bronto just crumbled right in front of me. <laughs> oh my god! They had tech wrecks. They had tech wrecks that they marched up here. Are they shooting tech right now? Ah, uh, they are dead tech rexes right up no, here. There's a guy with a tech rock on, or tech grenades. Really? Where do you see him? At the gates. The other side of the gates. Ah. Oh, nice. Maybe they'll get by. Oh, I see it. Threw a grenade right at me. I'm watching it unfold from uh, to above. There's a tech. Uh, I mean, there's not tech. There's a turret tower down there, though. Yeah, yeah. It's, I'm just. If he breaks the door, nothing's gonna. Literally, nothing's gonna happen. I'm kind of curious to see what their forces are looking like right now. Because they have just thrown a Titan and an ass load of Brontos at our turrets. And we've done nothing. We've done no defense. Yeah, we don't really have to. Those turrets are doing it. The base is doing our raid defense for us. Dude, all those massive amounts of Brontos that were up there, they're gone. They're all dead? They're all dead. Wow. They're all dead. Unless... Um, I see a TP pad over there. Unless they're about to teleport something else in, the massive assault that they've thrown at this base has failed. <laughs> failed base bad. Too strong. They got a too, base too strong. Base way too strong. Oh, they got patchy. Okay, they're going to soak on patchies now. They got UDs. They got cannon quetzals. This doesn't take cave damage. That's what makes this place so amazing. Yeah. This is normal. This is not cave damage whatsoever. Even though we're kind of inside of a cave, that's why it, why it makes it my favorite place to build on the uh, on the center map because it's broken OP. <laughs> I pissed off the Quetzal. Oh shit! Oh, I pissed off the Quetzal, and everything is coming here. One the it was one shot that just turned the tides. Not that the tides needed to be turned, but it was one shot that just took that raid in a completely different direction. <laughs> Good job, Nick. Good job. <laughs> uh, did they even do any damage? Not one broken turret. Base OP. Wow. I died from getting arced and fall damage more than any of their guys have killed Oh, no, me. they're doing a push on the... On the bottom? Right side, yeah. Nice. Oh, the, wait, which right? The, the Titan side or the non-Titan side? Non-Titan side. Okay. Like packies and stuff right here. My right or your right? Uh, Non-Titan side, basically. Gotcha. I see it. Actually, no one's on it. They're just on aggressive. What? I don't know. I'm, I'm letting... Jump right into the terror tower. I'm letting them... Yeah. I'm letting it go. Oh, I'm on the back of the Bronto now. Let's just program the skills my way through this. Nobody's on anything. It's just... It's just a massacre. It's a it's a massacre. It's, all, it's dead. It's dead. It's all gone. dead. All dead. They're too good. So massacred. Base too good. Even this Megalania is like coming. Is this is this a... This wild Megalania is coming to help. Megalania. He's gonna... No! The Megalania is gonna raid our base! Kill it. I got it. Mega AIDS. <laughs> it's gonna give me the Mega AIDS. Yes. I got it. Oh! Did you kill it? Yes. I captured it! He was my prisoner of war! Well, he was gonna he try to bite me. I'm gonna get this guy with these tech grenades. I'm gonna, I'm gonna play with some of these. Yeah, I got him. Oh, shit. Oh, the turrets! You savage, you grapple bobbed him! <laughs> <laughs> you savagely grapple bobbed him. Let me get some gamma state going a little bit, because it's dark in there. Everything. Do you even see a guy? Oh, mm. god, what happened? What hit me? The Bronto? It's on neutral, I'm guessing. Bait him? Yeah, bait it to the turret tower. Let's end this Bronto. He whacked me with his tail, and we can't have this. I'm gonna kill it before it gets to the tower. 
Are you gonna? Are you really gonna kill it though? No. It's a, he's, his knees. Bu I see, he scraped his knee. It's like Family Guy. He's like, ooh. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> he didn't have time to finish his third and fourth rounds of oohs and ahs. Yep. No. Killed him too fast. Yep. Way too fast. I can't believe that Titan though. That's, that died so fast. That's... And he got stuck. <laughs> the rock of... I'm going to call that one rock the rock of Nurbraltar from now on. Not the rock of Gibraltar, but the rock of Nurbraltar. Because that titan died to that one rock that could have been easily yeah. picked or destroyed with explosives. Mm -hmm. Just one rocket, and it would have been fine. One. F one. But the rock oh, I'm of... I'm going to loot this tech rex. Rock of Nurbraltar. Oh, good idea. I'm not even looting anything. I'm just still observing. We don't really need it, because season's going to end, but... Um, it's true. You know. and so, <laughs> and he had he had nine element. Yeah. Yoinks. Never have any melees. Cannon. Oh, God. Another one? Yeah. I know I could use the butt of my gun, but I don't want to mess with it. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, it's that on there, really Fob. almost killed me. I have the hardest of beats. Is that what they've resorted to? Mm-hmm. I'm going to see if I can snipe him then. I have super broken leg. Fall damage is not my friend. I have no friends right now. No friends? No friends. Rip. Sorry, Nick. It's okay. It feels, feels good. Bad. Where? He's got to be crouched down or something. I need a better angle. It's not really a good angle on him. I don't think it's going to happen. If... <laughs> We're not even going to push their fob. This is the end of the season. We just wanted to see if anything could happen to the Nerd Parade base. And thus far, the Nerd Parade history of unraidability holds up. Holds up. I got a little bit of, little bit of a height. I've hit him a couple times. Have you? Yeah, they have good armor, though. Stand up, you turd. Stand up. I can't get a good angle on this guy to hit him. My dangle is nowhere near as powerful as yours. Although I'm getting close to turrets. Oh, that might hit me. Oh, there we go. Oh, you got it! I, as soon as I got up there, I just watched his body spaz out. Do they have anything left? They have two tech rexes and a UD. That's about it, I think. They can still do it. Two tech rexes and a UD. I believe in them. You believe I, believe Nick? In, I believe in them. I'm actually going to see if they got anything else to port back in. They have nothing left. We asked them if they had anything left to teleport in. They said they had nothing else that they could throw at the base. The Nerd Parade base stands firm <laughs> as unraidable this season. The, two, the base built by two men, raided by many men. Many, as in like small. Just kidding. As in multiple men, the base built by two stood up to an army of Brontos, a Titan, Tech Rexes, UDs, and came out com basically completely unscathed. We lost a couple of Dino Gates. May they be remembered and rest in peace. Rex? Yes? Pour one out for my homie Dino Gates. <laughs> Amazing grace Wait, no, no, it's in the arms of an angel I'm sorry, in the arms of Okay, we're not gonna do that, but thank you guys so much For hanging with us today Watching my pleb-like deaths I swear I got arced, it was uh, gravity We didn't even need our tech bubble Our base survives Because this place is OP It's the cave of Opinus and I'm glad that we built here. It was super awesome. And kudos to you guys who saw our bed on the map and figured it out that we were built in here. But that is going to wrap up the episode today, wrap up the season, and the finale of Two Men, One Base on the center. Be prepared for the next season of Two Men, One Base on Ragnarok. We look forward to it, and I hope you guys do too. Please remember to take care of yourself. Smash the thumbs up button for us if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to the page if you haven't done so yet. Get a drink if you're just as thirsty as I am. But most importantly of all, remember to take care of yourselves and stay awesome out there, guys. We'll catch you in the next season of Two Men, One Base.